Most of the time, when a premium smartphone like the Galaxy S20 gets stuck on a black screen of death, it's just due to a minor firmware issue. And if that's really the case, then you only have to do one or a couple of procedures to make your phone work smoothly again. In this video, we will show you what to do if your Galaxy S20 got stuck on a black screen after the Android 11 update. First solution, check your phone for physical damage. Before doing anything, the first thing you have to do is make sure your phone doesn't have any signs of physical or liquid damage. Just do a physical inspection on all the sides of your device as well as its backside. If there are dents or scratches, then the cause of the black screen issue might be due to physical damage. If there are also cracks on the screen, it's possible that only the display is damaged. For hardware related issues, you should have your phone checked. However, if everything looks smooth on the outside, then move on to the next solution. Second solution, perform the forced restart. The next thing you have to do if your Galaxy S20 doesn't have any visible signs of physical damage is the forced restart. If it's just due to a firmware issue, then this should be enough to fix it. Here's how it's done. Press and hold the volume down button and the power key for 10 seconds. This will force your phone to shut down and then power back up. When the logo shows, release both keys and wait until the reboot is finished. If you can make the logo show on the screen, then that's a sign that the problem is already fixed. However, if it remains to be unresponsive even after this, then try the next solution. Third solution, charge your phone and do the forced restart. After doing the first two solutions and your phone is still not responding, then it's possible that the battery is fixed and that the firmware crashed just before the device powered down. To address that, here's what you should do. Plug the charger to a working wall outlet. Connect the phone to it using the original cable. Regardless of whether the charging sign shows or not, leave it connected to the charger for at least 10 minutes. After that, press and hold the volume down button and the power key for 10 seconds. If the logo shows, then release both keys and just wait until the device has finished rebooting. Once the boot process is completed, the problem should already be fixed. However, if your phone is still stuck on a black screen after all this, then it's time you have it checked. We hope that this simple troubleshooting guide has been helpful. Please support us by subscribing to our channel and enabling notifications. Thanks for watching.